Now on Fox 35 News at 10. Coming up on Fox 35 News at 10, a soccer player sidelined by a devastating injury. Her dreams of going pro on hold. Devastating that I couldn't play a sport that I played for years. After the break, how doctors use the girl's stem cells to get her back on the soccer field. New at 10, a local soccer player gets sidelined by an injury and a rare condition. Right. Her, her dreams of playing professionally are dashed until one doctor performs a game-changing surgery. Fox 35's Keith Burgess reports. <laughs> Watching Natasha Marangoli run drills. Playing soccer just... <laughs> Set your mind free. You wouldn't guess two years ago, doctor said she'd never play soccer again. Devastating that I couldn't play a sport that I played for years. <laughs> in December of 2012, she hurt her ankle and didn't think much of it, though she was playing and living in constant pain. It felt like someone like stabbing me from like the inside of my foot out. That of. stabbing yeah. feeling was her bone dying, a condition called avascular necrosis, where the bone can't get enough blood flow. Problem with it. With the avascular necrosis, when the bone dies, is it can collapse, and then you get a very rapid secondary degeneration. The most common cause is from trauma, um, but oftentimes people who are especially athletes, um, they experience aches and pains all the time, and so they just think it's going to get better, and it just... After a few months of not getting better, several doctors told Natasha her only option was ankle fusion surgery to pick a new sport. Then she met Dr. Dennis Locks, who said he could save her ankle and her soccer career with her own stem cells. Stem cells home. They home to areas of injury. Dr. Locks showed us how he harvested stem cells from Natasha's abdomen and injected them directly into her ankle. Stem cells are basically cells in the body that can become other types of cells. Transforming into cartilage and bone, bringing the dead bone back to life. The one stem cell injection right here, mm -hmm. and she basically recovered. Yes. In just under six months, Natasha was back on the field. Some days I forget which way it was because I don't feel anything anymore. Five, six, seven, eight, eight nine, ten, ten, eleven, twelve. Her dreams of playing pro soccer back on track. With 23 goals this past season as a freshman, she was the top scorer on Boone High School's varsity girls team. It was, it was very rewarding to see that you gave somebody an alternate destiny. And it was the, it was a destiny that she wanted, which was to continue to play soccer. I'm Kate Burgess, Fox 35 News. Isn't that incredible? Doctors diagnose actually up to about 100,000 new cases of avascular necrosis every year. Simple stem cell regenerative surgeries typically cost around $5,000, and they are not, however, covered by insurance.